for a rally here. So we've got to be closed. So have you declared and calmed that soul down? And then I pray our morning creed. Each and every one of them, and I'm going to look for an answer. Because God is a reward of them that diligently seek him. Mm -hmm. And that love him. He's our father. The father always gives his children good things. Mm -hmm. And what they, what he knows is best for them. And that's what we're going to ask for tonight. Ask yeah. and ye shall receive. Seek and ye shall find. Okay. Okay. Knock and it shall be opened unto you. Okay. Ask and keep on asking. Yes. I think that's what we need. Oops. God, y'all forgive us. We um, are kind of semi-prepared. Um, Sandy, will you check that door? It sounds like it's cracked. We were just out on the deck, and I'm not sure we closed the door good. <laughs> Mom was so bent on to, on opening or closing the curtain that we didn't get the door closed. So um, this is a different setup than we normally have, and I'm hoping that you can hear us talk and you can hear us sing. And oh, Sandy, did it require all that? Because the chair is bumping up oh. against the damn office chair every two seconds. I'm sorry, y'all. We're just here in my living room. <laughs> <laughs> I've been gone all week, so I just got home. And, we all went to dinner together and just um, mom wanted to come back and go live because she's been missing you all. And certainly we all have. And we're thankful that we're family and that we have the opportunity to miss each other, that we care enough that we miss each other. All right, here we go. All right. this if nobody else knows the words if you'll just give mama a second, second. you'll hear she'll, it she'll, and you'll know what the next one is because she's got it like if you say them incorrectly right. you didn't get that so i'm just going to do this on but you already i'll play where you start at the beginning
This world I've taken wings. That's the verse that I like. Okay. Just he abides. He is with me. Oh, there's no thirsty for the things. Yeah. I said we were going to do this when I showed the picture of that. <laughs> Thank you. 
coming and going. We're gonna have if much more, and they're gonna want us to go to Mexico <laughs> and get what the what do you call that band? The mariachi. The mariachi band, band. <laughs> Lord. Oh, <gasps> yes, in heaven we all gonna be playing something. something. I guarantee you. That's right. And we can't wait. He mm -hmm. said to make a joyful noise. That's right. Day. He didn't say it had to be pretty. He just yes. said it had to be a noise. We That's right. We don't want the rocks crying out because we're not praising them. Amen. This is what I thought about when you were playing. Somewhere just across the Jordan River There's a place of everlasting joy and peace where the stream of life
play the beatbox. She doesn't know it yet, but she's no, going to. That would be a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow the beatbox just doesn't work with the red bag. <laughs> you, you and him will wait until you see my brain. Yes, ma'am. Wait until you see my brain. the first time. If you're all by this world and all Ah! 
Guys, y'all see Dina um, Smith Branham on here. We got to meet her last weekend in Alabama in Gardendale. Mom and I did, and Ann and Sandy and everybody around. We have known her from Facebook, and I don't know if you follow Dina, but it's D E E. Let me let me not give you too many E's, Dina. D E E N A Smith Branham B R A N U N N U M. You need to go hear her play. She's got the prettiest style. Come on through, Sandy. Oh, I'm all right. That's yours. Yes. Yes. <coughs> but um, she has family here in Myrtle Beach. So when she comes to Myrtle Beach the next time, if I can impose upon her, she has an invitation to come um, and be with me. Yes, Grace Notes with Dina is her Facebook music page. And it's beautiful. She's such a, a lovely person. Um, and her playing just matches her personality. It's really cool. To see that, I guess if playing matches personality, mine's kind of big and boisterous and overdone. And, and smooth and silky yeah. and gorgeous. It's all, it's all wrapped up in some hideous package. <laughs> okay, y'all haven't been giving us any requests, so I'm just, just we're just having a good time. Someone did request this. Um, 
I'll play it where you can sing it, Sandy, page 78. Can you send me a string shot? <laughs> I think Gina's on here. I'm not sure, but I think she's on. She's going to kill me. <laughs> no, here's what she just requested. <laughs> oh, I should play it there. We are the light fighters. <laughs> Gina, now we're going to go back. Oh, it was Kimberly. Kimberly, I didn't even know you knew that. I thought that was something Prospect only did. <laughs> That's pretty That's, you weren't in our kids' class. You should be That's punished for that. <laughs> Somebody says we're frozen. I don't see it. It's it it. My iPad is supposed to show me exactly what's being sent out. Um, once it leaves here, I don't have any control over it. And Facebook does some buffering when it's real real busy. So if you're if you are, um, I've got to quit saying um so much. <laughs> if you are having issues, this would be a good just, just give it a little time. Yeah, Facebook or go out will, and come back in. Facebook will catch up. Yeah. Miss Leela says we're fine, and she's in California. So if Go, it's making it, if it's yeah. making it to the wet, to the to the um, west coast, I think we're okay. <laughs> and Faye is in Australia, and she says it's okay. So, um, and Harriet said that she remembered we are the lifeline. <laughs> Harriet, it must have been a South Carolina or coastal South Carolina thing because mm -hmm. Kimberly remembered it. We do, uh, and Harriet yeah. grew up in the Georgetown um, church. So, oh mercy! All the good people knew it. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> We're gonna get Army. us. We're gonna have war. <laughs> hey.
Hey guys, let me let me um, let me just be serious for a moment. I love doing this and having fun because I feel like I feel like that's what heaven's going to be. It's not going to be casual, so. but it's going to be fun. We can have fun, but not be casual about um, about our faith and our our walk with God. Um, we were talking with Anna James and and uh, Mark this afternoon when Mom and I were driving over to the beach and Mom. In her, in her own way, she said, Mark, I like to cut up and have a good time, but I'm serious about my Lord and serious about my relationship with the Lord. And that's really how we all are. But I don't see any harm in, in laughing and cutting up. But, but for serious, just one second. Um, I've been kind of out of pocket. I haven't watched news, but I've heard that there's been something going on in Israel um, between Iran, I think, and Israel. Iran. And uh, I would just ask you to pray for our globe, the whole world, we know that there will never be peace, um, complete peace. But we need to pray that through all of this turmoil that God will get glory somehow. And, and I don't understand all the things about the Bible that there'll be wars and rumors of wars. And, you know, if God is a good God, why is there war? I can't answer those questions. That's not for me to answer. It's for me to trust him, but it's also for me to pray to him, believing that he can bring peace. I love, I love, and I've got to go research this and find out which pope said this, but one of the Roman Catholic popes was asked the question after a horrible storm, if God was a good God, why did he allow this? And his answer was, it's not my answer, it's his answer, that storms, even in our own lives, in our own bodies, happen out of nature. Just because we live in this natural world, there are things that are going to happen. There are consequences. There are consequences not going political or anything, but there are consequences to the way we live as far as the way we consume and what we consume and what we, you know, I, 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 I hate the idea of the trash that we generate. It just, it just disturbs me. Um, there are consequences to that. The Pope said that these things that happen are nature. These storms, they come because of the atmospheric conditions. Um, but where God shows up is through his people when we show up to help. In the storm. In the storm. Mm -hmm. And to me, that's what we are supposed to do, yes. I can't tell you my intellect is not sufficient enough to grasp the concept of how God designed the globe, our, our, not just the globe, but our entire planet, our entire universe, and how things are supposed to happen and not happen, um, and how we are even free will agents, but yet he's in control. I don't, I don't understand all of that, but there's a point where I trust it. And, and I, want, I want him to be in me so that I'll show up to help Amen. others. Amen. And, and I, just, I just want to take a moment to say, pray for the countries that are at war. Because believe it or not, we're at war. We're at civil war. We, I, I've, I've not seen, I'm 62 years old and in my lifetime I've not seen America at unrest like it is right now. We, we all need to pray and pray that it starts in us. Pray that pray that when we approach our fellow man, we approach him and her with the respect and with the peace that we would like to remain there after we leave. I had one of the most painful confrontations I've had in my life in the last two days. Mm -hmm. But it was done in peace. It was respectful. And when we left, we shook hands, thanked each other, went on about our business. You can do that mm -hmm. as Christian people, and that's what you should do. You can even be at fault, but respect each other and be able to talk through that. And because we have different lifestyles and because we have different um, lives and we come from different cultures doesn't ha that doesn't have to divide us 
our common ground, our unifying ground should be our faith. And so many times our faith divides us. I wish I could remember what Mike was talking about. Sandy's husband's a pastor, Mike Welch. Y'all saw him at the Myrtle Beach event. We were we was talking about something that he talked about in church about this morning. In all things, bring glory to God. Bring glory to God, regardless of what it is. And if you if if you approach situations correctly and respectfully, you will bring glory to God. Amen. But but sometimes that glory, when things are not handled correctly, take a long time to see the glory of God in it. Mm -hmm. So anyway. For what that's worth, I don't know why I went there, but Mama said, told Mark and Anna this afternoon that I could preach, so <laughs> I guess I'm trying to live up to that, but she's the one who's got the license to preach, or so she thinks. Preach on, Mama. All right, so, what, um, anything else? We've, we've been on 47 minutes, so we got to go to bed so you can go home. My daddy used to say, when people were at our house, when people yeah. were always at our, our house, house, he said, we're going to go to bed so y'all can leave. <laughs> <laughs> so, Mike, would you sing one? Sing with you? Yeah, come, come sit on the piano bench. Sandy's, Sandy's husband actually is a, now, is a great a singer. Yeah, he he sang tenor with his college, college choir. Yeah, college, yeah. So what's something you know? It doesn't matter. I mean, not, you know. Play something you know, and then I'll see if I can join in. Sandy, what? Did y'all do To God Be the Glory yet? Mm -mm. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. To God Be the Glory, Andre Crouch. Oh, yeah. oh, my tribute? Yeah, my tribute. Good yeah. Lord, live large. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mike, have a mic? This will pick, it, pick it up, Sandy. <laughs> okay. This is the same as that one. If you can't reach this, I can change the key. Okay. I know you can't. Thank you. 
singing preacher that's a great combination <laughs> so we want i want you to go and watch um uh what's his name in the kaji church um <laughs> he sings that after like mr duncan you yeah. know mr duncan will preach this i mean this oration that's just you got vocabulary words in it that long and um then he'll come out with some song and it's just like yeah it's like butter Gracious. Yeah, it's I like good. to break out in song yeah. sometime when I'm preaching. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you know a song, done, Mama, yeah. that, thank you, Mike, This a song that I really enjoyed, and I played this the other night, and I don't think anybody knew it. Um, and I don't know that that, um, that I can remember all of it, but we sang it at Lake City, and we sang it at camp meeting. Zion and everlasting joy shall be upon their head. They shall obtain gladness and joy and sorrow and mourning shall flee away. Therefore the redeemed of the Lord shall return and come with singing Lasting joy shall be upon them. That's great scripture. Love that. Oh, mm -hmm. It's very visual for me. Mm -hmm. You know. And I like I like songs that are equation. Or equations. Therefore the redeemed of the Lord <laughs> shall return Plus. unto Zion. <laughs> and everlasting joy they shall obtain. <laughs> so if you do this, then this will happen. Right. I just like this. I'll, I'm sorry. It's that black and white part of no, it that great. gets crossed up. <laughs> Are you tired, Mama? I'm tired, Mama. Are you tired? <laughs> I'm not ready to eat till you get to the end. <laughs> okay. Y'all heard that she's ready for me to end. Yeah, I promise I'm not crying. Right? Yes, ma'am. Well, we're going to yeah. give you a, sh a chance. Let me use you want me to go get a podium and bring it in? Or? <laughs> No, right. very humble. She doesn't like that, that I'm cutting up now. She's very humble. Mm. Okay. All right, come play "Wonderful Grace of Jesus" with me, and then we'll we'll um, pray us out of here. We'll let you pray us out, or ask you to pray us out. You need to p pull up some. <laughs> Where do you want to play it? See, it was just filling in. She takes a whole keyboard. <laughs> I mean, this is where I'm going to be. Okay, with. well, give me just a minute. Let me do the intro. <laughs>
you know what? I always remember. Um, I think I'll be 90 years if I live to be 90. Sister Elizabeth. Thank you. Our Father in heaven, uh, you the great king of this earth tonight and acknowledge that you are. Your word tells us that in <coughs> our prayer. And we thank you for this very moment of time. Thank you for all the listeners that are tuned in tonight to Briley Playing. We thank you for their Christian life, Lord. And if there's one that's not ready, Lord, that hadn't given their life to Jesus, I pray that you would deal with them and, and show them the way and make it so interesting, Lord, that they would hunger and thirst after your righteousness. Grant that people tonight everywhere would turn back to God. We live in, in days that people need to pray so they won't faint. That's what's happening to America People are not using the tools that were given them from the beginning, prayer and scripture that will keep them holy and make them strong and devout. And Lord, we ask you to deal with people's hearts tonight, even Christians, Lord, that are careless and slack about reading God's word and having prayer time during the day and the night. Oh, we just thank you. And we ask you to remember each and every prayer request that was given in tonight. Lord, by each one of our precious friends, Lord, that we love so good and thank you for them. I pray that you would answer and help them to know that, that you are there for them and that you're tuned in day and night. You never sleep. You never slumber. Your word says that. And that you're ready to give us help. Help us on the way. You are on that royal telephone. And help us all to call upon you, Lord, when needed. And praise you and thank you for all that you do for us from day to day. You've been a great, wonderful Savior today, Lord, to all of America. And I thank you. Thank you for food to eat. Thank you for the many blessings that have come our way, Lord, provisions that you have made for us. But I ask you one more time, Lord, to heal the sick, comfort the sad. Remember Brother Donald Duncan in Lake City, Lord. Stand by him. Help him to know that the Lord is standing by his side, and he understands, and he cares. Lord, I just ask you again to heal and provide that that's needed for each and every one of us. And help us to stay ready to go, ready to stay. Do your will, Lord, at all times and breathe upon us a spirit of prayer day and night. And we commit our lives unto you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. amen. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you all.
собираем. Она сама готовит. Она твоя, что ли?